top of the afternoon to you. Happy St. Patrick's Day from the Benton History Center. Uh, it's time again for our Museum from Home video. And this week, we wanted to feature something from one of Jamestown's Irish families. Uh, so we all talked about it. And actually, the video from last week with Nancy Thompson Prendergast's sampler, uh, without even thinking that would've been a great one for today because the Prendergast family was Irish. So today we have another artifact that belonged to the Prendergast family. This little table behind me was made in approximately 1814 by a man named Phineas Palmetter Jr. And for James Prendergast, uh, who is the founder of Jamestown. Uh, the library is named after his grandson. Uh, according to an editorial that was in the Chautauqua Democrat in 1870, this table was the first article of its kind ever manufactured in Jamestown. So it might actually be the first piece of furniture professionally made in Jamestown. Uh, the article further states that Mr. Prendergast used this stand with its drawer as a bank in his house. And uh, at that time, it was still in the possession of the Prendergast family. It was positively identified as the same table uh, in 1925 by Arthur Wellington Anderson, who was a city historian. Um, Mr. Palmiter was born in 1790 and came to Jamestown in 1813. Um, and he died in 1861 in Pittsfield, Pennsylvania. But this table belonged to the Prendergasts. They said they were an Irish family. So Jamestown was actually started by an Irish immigrant. So, um, when people ask you about if you're Irish for St. Patrick's Day, you can say, well, kind of. I'm from Jamestown and Jamestown was originally Irish. Now today's video uh, is actually one day short of the one year anniversary of our first Museum From Home video. Uh, one year ago tomorrow, we made our first video uh, on the same day that we were ordered to shut down due to the COVID-19 crisis. I would like to thank everyone for continuing to watch us for a year. If I counted right, this is video number 113. Um, and I appreciate you watching any and all of them. Uh, you can go back through on our Facebook or uh, on our YouTube channel and see the old videos uh, in case you missed something. And thankfully at this time, the Fenton History Center is open. So please wear a mask when you visit us, but come in and visit us check out the Irish uh, artifacts as well as the rest of the house. And we're still posting new stuff on our website and on our social media accounts. So on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and uh, FentonHistoryCenter.org. And we're also members of Patreon. Uh, so if you'd like to support the Fenton History Center in a new way, consider becoming a patron through Patreon. Uh, thank you for watching. Happy one year. <laughs> Have a wonderful day.